Hello everyone, welcome back. And today video, I would like to show you how to install Hack in Talks on your normal PC. And on a previous video, I already made a video on the high Sierra and many of you have the problem with the installation. But so today I would like to show you how to install the Hack in Talks Mojave on your normal PC. First, you need to download the Mojave DMG file. So you can navigate to this website here. On the left side, you can see the download button. So click on download download and then you can choose download hack in those more highway and then you can scroll down a bit and you will see the download button so click on download now and then click on agree and download and before you can download make sure you like the Facebook page or you can share and I already like and then you can wait and then you can see the download button here and remember that you need to have an account on hack into you can create an account and then you can log in to download if you don't have an account you cannot download so make sure you create your account on hack into and then click on download here and then you can see the file here so click on open so in folder and then you need to extract the folder extract to nearest mojave and then you can open the folder in order to download this file you need torrent and the file is about 6 gigabyte and for me i have already downloaded the file here so on the desktop and then i can use the usb here so i recommend using 16 gigabyte and if you have 8 gigabyte of um, usb flash drive it is okay so you can plug into your computer so you can open transmac and transmac the link can be found in description so you can open and then click on run and you can right click on the USB and then click on install with this image click on yes and click on run again and right click and then install with this image click on yes and then you can pick the file that you have just download so my file is on desktop and you can see here nearest Mojave and then click on open and click on ok and then click on yes and then it will doing it process so it take about 15 to 20 minutes to create a bootable usb and after it say restore complete you can unplug your usb and then you can plug into the computer that you want to install the mac mojave now i have my hp probook laptop with my hand here and then i can plug in the usb that we have just made the bootable usb and then plug into the computer and now you can power it on and then I can click on escape key to go to boot device option. On my HP, I go, I can click on escape key to go to boot device option. If you have different computer and different model, it gonna have different key. So make sure you check it on the internet. And then you can click on F9 to go to boot device option. And then you can use the arrow down to go to boot from EFL file and click on the enter key. And now you can choose the second one, click on the enter key again and go to EFI folder and click on Clover and then click on Clover864.EFI So click on the enter key So make sure you can boot Mac OS, install from Nires Mojave and then click on the enter key And you can see the script running around on the screen and don't worry about it so be patient and wait for the screen to pass and now you are on the installation screen so you can click on continue and then click on continue again and click on agree and then before you install make sure you go to terminal so click on utilities click on terminal And then you need to change the date to avoid the error while you are installing. So you can type that space 09240000 and then 19 and then click on the turn key or enter key. And now it is done. So we can close the terminal. You can click on terminal and, and then click on quit terminal. And then you can go back to utility again and then click on this utility so we need to erase the hard drive so you can click on the internal one and then click on erase and make sure you choose mac os journal and click on erase again i have to remind you that if you erase this one 
all of the file and the data on your computer will be deleted so make sure you back up before doing the process and then click on done and now you can close this utility so quit it and now choose Mojave and click on customize before you install and you need to install some driver and bootloader should be Clover UEFI and click and graphic and chipset so this already check for you and make sure you check this one as well so for the Wi-Fi and then click on accept and now click on continue and now you are on the installing page so you can wait and be patient it does take some time to finish this installation And now the installation is finished and you can see it will automatically restart and now it is restarting Now we are on the final step to set up the Mac, so just follow what I did.
finally we are on the home screen of the Mac OS Mojave on the normal PC and thank you for watching everyone and I hope you like this video and if you have any question related to the installation you can comment down below and I will try to answer as much as possible